So in this video, we've got a lot of news about Euro 2024 event in FC Mobile. We do know some of the players that are going to come out that have been leaked uh, by uh, by EA Sports FC Mobile, I guess, on Twitter. And also, we do know how the event is going to go go on and how, it, how it's going to look. So I'm going to go ahead and show that to you right now. So make sure to like and subscribe if you're excited for it. We just opened this pack right there. We didn't re really get anything good. But this is the second day, so we're going to be able to get some free coins here. What is it? 1.5 million coins we'll take it it's not a lot of course but we'll take it so basically we're gonna get uh, a live stream tomorrow we're also gonna get a new redeem code as well on that live stream we're gonna get a redeem code and make sure you go on and watch that live stream um full the fully light make sure to watch it uh, you watch it at the uh, until the end or if you if you don't want to watch it until the end i'm gonna make a video about it very very soon and i'm gonna I'm probably going to tell you the redeem code as well, what the redeem code is going to be. So you will be able to, uh, you will be able to get that reward by just redeeming that code on EA site, EA Sports uh, site, uh, and uh, you're obviously going to get a reward on FC Mobile as well. We don't know what the reward is going to be, what the gift is going to be, but it is probably going to, uh, it's going to be up probably for about like 12 hours. So you should be fast enough. This is what they've tweeted lately. As you can see right there, this is just for the heads up that FC Mobile will be undergoing maintenance starting June 11th, 2 a.m. UTC. If you don't know what 2 a.m. UTC is for your country, you can just go ahead and type 2 a.m. UTC to your time or wherever you are, uh, to your country or to your region, whatever, and you will find out uh, what time it is for you at that exact time. Uh, for the Euro uh, UEFA, sorry, Euro 2024 update, UEFA Euro 2024 tournament mode is gonna be added as well as training transfer is gonna be made and there are gonna be gameplay, uh, gameplay improvements. So there's gonna be a big, big update. And during this time, you may not be able to access the game. Stay posted for further information. If you don't know what the gameplay updates are gonna be, they're pretty much gonna make like defending a bit better, I think, passing a bit better and something like that. Um, passing just before you shoot, like when you, when you go one-on-one, -on -one, you're that that's going to become better and stuff like that if you want to check that out there is going to be a detailed uh detailed uh, review i guess for that gameplay as well tomorrow on stream so we're going to check that one out as well this is the tournament mode then as you can see right there we're going to have all of these groups and we can choose one of this one of these teams and we need to win the whole tournament win this one team with this one team and we're gonna get rewards uh some points or tokens maybe like euro tokens euro points and maybe some players as well some like player packs some like that um and they're gonna be like di different difficulties they're gonna be highest dif uh, lowest difficulty to highest difficulty in the more difficult tournament rewards you sh uh, tournaments you choose the more rewards and more tokens you're probably gonna get so this is how euro 24 event is gonna look as you can see right there this is from separate on twitter or on x um as it's called right now there is gonna be uh, five chapters chapter one is gonna be intro i guess there's gonna there is not gonna be nothing there it's just gonna tell tell it's just gonna tell you what what's going on in the euro event or maybe we're gonna get some milestones in there or something like that uh then chapter two is gonna be euro journey skill games timer six stage so we're gonna get skill games to get some tokens probably and then we can spend those tokens to get some rewards chapter three is gonna be euro adventure match day 24 team source um this is probably gonna be like maybe uh, something that we got uh, during team of the season right now where we can play matches and then we can spend those uh spend those points that we can get from worst attack head to head or ai matches uh we can spend those tokens uh, in store packs I'm not sure. I'm not sure what it's going to be, but we're definitely going to get some some type of packs in that chapter. Then chapter four is going to be live overall six groups. So we are going to get live overall players as well for Euro, which means we're, uh, it's probably going to be like that, right? When when the team does well, they're probably going to get upgraded. For example, if Portugal uh, go ahead and win match, win a match, if Ronaldo gets a card, live card, for example, is going to get upgraded. It's going to become a higher overall and um, if, if they go on to become the champions, this is probably going to be even more, even higher overall. And then chapter five is going to be rewards, three plus two milestones, update quickly. There are going to be uh, different milestones. There are going to be three milestones and two of them, I think, are going to uh, update weekly. So that, that's, I guess, something decent. Then here is a guy asking uh, live overall. It means player will get live overall update in separate um separate answered with yes but i need to exchange you need to exchange the older version i guess to get the uh, get get the new version to get uh to, to get a higher raw card i think that's what it means 
and here is the information about the redeem code if you don't know already euro 24 on june 11th that's gonna be the tournament and the new redeem code as well it's gonna be on live stream at the end of the live stream we're gonna be able to see it um live stream episode 39 wait until then to get the redeem code and now this is what has been leaked right there as you can see these four players have been linked you got a 99 overall these are all probably icons as well 99 overall Dutch central midfielder, 98 overall right back uh, German, we've got 98 overall striker that is um, uh, that is Spanish and the 97 overall right midfielder that is from England. So I, I feel like the 99 overall central mid can obviously be a couple of players uh, right card, but maybe like he's going to get a CDM position, uh, there, like Seedorf can be as well as some other cards, but obviously everybody everybody pretty much wants that Hullet card, right? Hullet has already got a 99 overall card though, so I feel like Hullet might not get this 99 overall card, not sure, but everyone wants Hullet, 98 overall right back. Um, that's gonna be Philip Lam, right? That's got to be Philip Lam. A World Cup as well. Yeah, he was he was so so good for Germany. He lifted the World Cup as well. I'm pretty sure, right? He was the captain, so he's great. 97 overall right midfielder. Um, probably, I mean, probably Beckham, right? It can be McManaman as well, but probably Beckham in the 98 overall striker. I would guess Fernando Torres, and we're gonna get a 92 overall version as a free. I think I think that's what's gonna happen with that one. Can be obviously Raul and the other ones, but uh, and also David Villa. But David Villa does not have an icon card, right? So I feel like that has got to be Fernando Torres right there. Here are some of the cards from Giga Game right there on Twitter again. I'm just in uh, one of the comments, and this is act this actually looks good. 97 overall right midfielder could be McManaman right there. I did say that 98 overall right back. I think it's guaranteed to be Philip Lam. 98 overall striker. He went with Morientes right there. Could be Morientes, of course. Could be. A, we've got a lot of icon or hero strikers from Spain, but I feel like it's gonna be Torres still. 99 overall um, central midfielder is Holy there as well, uh, and I think yeah, everybody pretty much wants that Holy card, right? So now let me go into the exchange section and open at least this 94 to 99 overall player pack. I do want to open another one of these, but. I just don't want to put these 97 overall cards in. If I get some 95, 96s, I'm definitely gonna do it, but I'm not sure right now. I'm not sure because I don't really want to waste my 90 overall cards um, on these packs as well, on these exchanges, because I want to have my 90 overall cards when I get them ready for a uh, team, the, not team of the season, um, Euro 24 event. So let me first of all go ahead and open this pack right there. Oh, we got 87 and 84 overall. That's, like, that's actually quite good from that pack. But from here, we're gonna see what we can pack. I'm gonna put, who do I have two of? I've got Vardy, I've got two Bento Labs. I've got, uh, I'm gonna put Mickey Terran. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get him back because I'm, I pack him so, so many times. Then we're gonna put um, Anton as well, I guess. Okay, let's see. 94 to 99 overall player pack. We can get all the 99 overall icons, obviously. So let's see if you're gonna get one of them. We've got German. It's gonna be, a, is that Anton? Oh, that is, that is Ta, Jonathan Ta. 96 overall Jonathan Ta, that's actually not bad. If I if if I got um two okay we've got two more ninety fours I was gonna say if I if I get like one or two more ninety five pluses from this pack then I might go and open this pack and just waste those two ninety sevens but I'm not gonna do it right now.